Hi, Gemini. I'm going to find out what is going to happen in April for you. What's coming up. There's a lot happening in April for Gemini. A lot happening for you. Okay, so we have the Four of Wands. You could be getting a new house. This is stability coming in. Um, you've been through a lot, Gemini. You're kind of showing up here as the wounded warrior where you've been through a lot for quite a long time but you're still standing i'm going to lay out all the cards and then i'm going to clarify them there is something that you've been waiting for and i do see this coming in in april for you There could be someone at a distance from you, but we'll find out when we clarify. I've tried to make this video three times and things keep going wrong, and so I know there's a lot going on. Yeah, and then we have the Sun card and the Death card. Something's coming to an end. But with the Sun card coming right after it, it is the happiest card in the deck. So there's a huge, happy change coming in for you. Spirits Gemini for April. Gemini. Yeah, something's changing everything, Gemini. We have the Tower now. A huge, huge ch change in your life is taking place. But it is a happy change. Things are going to work out really good. Um, I do see you being single here in April, but you will be getting material gain. Gemini. There's someone that you've been waiting for for a really long time. And I see this person showing up in April for you. They're coming in with um, maybe an apology, but they're coming in with some type of gift. They're coming in right. And then we have the Ten of Pentacles. So this person's very, very stable. Gemini, whoever's coming to you, it's someone you can depend on. This is material gain again. This is money, stability. Wow, and then you got the Ace of Pentacles too. So this is a brand new start. This change is huge, significant, and it's really going to change your life for the better. Gemini. April 2021 Gemini. and I see this this is a brand new beginning in love so let's clarify the cards and find out okay so we have the Emperor why is the four of wands here spirits and justice The scales are going to be balanced out in April. There could This could have something to do with a legal matter or you getting a house. It's something about stability where you're going to be feeling very, very stable. You're going to be taking control. You're going to feel in control. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Okay, and this is something that, that you've given up on 
and they're telling you not to give up. It's something that you feel like you put a lot of work into, but um, they're telling you not to give up, to keep standing. And I do see you standing here in your power and and holding the holding holding yourself in place and not giving up yet. Why is the Three of Wands here? Spirit. Okay, so we have the Magician. Why is the Three of Wands here for Gemini? And Strength. This is something that you've been manifesting, something that you want really bad, that's taken a lot of inner strength and something you've been waiting for for, for a long time now. Why is the death card in the sun here? Okay, so to clarify the death card in the sun, we have the seven of swords and the princess of wands. There was something that was hidden from you. But with the sun card, it's going to be illuminated and you're going to be able to see everything clearly. It was something that was hidden. And um, you're going to go after something with a lot of passion that you want. Nothing's going to stop you. You're going after this, Gemini. Why is the tower here, spirits? Okay, the towers here, because there was ruin, like everything was over. There was an ending, a very painful ending. But the tower's coming in to take this pain away. It's at the Ten of Swords, and so the pain is over. You're, you're literally putting an end to this pain in April. Okay, so to clarify the Knight of Pentacles, we have the Five of Swords. This is, this is a person that you gave up on. Like you felt defeated, like there was nothing you could do. And you turned your back and you gave up and you walked away. But I do see this person coming back in April. They're coming back. Offering an apology. This person um, could have caused like a lot, of, a lot of problems. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? The spirits. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Okay, they want me to get another deck. Why is the Ten of Pentacles here, Spirits? Okay, yeah, and again, this is something that you've been waiting for, Gemini. Something that you worked for that's going to be coming in for you in April. This is great material wealth and it's here for you in April. Why is the Nine of Pentacles here, Spirits? I'm going to clarify this Nine of Pentacles. There's a lot of Pentacles here. Okay, and this Nine of Pentacles is clarified by the Seven of Cups. So this is you having a lot of different options. You being single, having a lot of different options. Um, you could be communicating with people online. Why is the Ace of Pentacles here, Spirits? Okay, so we have the Six of Pentacles and the Seven of Swords. 
this is this is someone who could have been sneaky in the past they could have been withholding information lying cheating or stealing but now they want equal give and take and they're trying to bring you this ace of pentacles they're trying to give you it all why is the ace of cups here spirits for gemini why is the ace of cups here Okay, so this new love, this Ace of Cups here, this is someone that you have a lot of love for. You've got a lot of love for this person. And they're coming in as the King of Wands. And so this is someone who comes towards you with a lot of passion. They'll jump through so many obstacles not to take no for an answer. They know what they want and they go after it. And I feel like this person is at a distance from you and they are coming in quickly in April and bringing you your Ten of Cups. This is complete emotional happiness, happy family, happy home. And so um, right now you're having a lot of courage because you're going through like the tower moment, the, the tower and this Ten of Swords, a lot of swords, a lot of pain. But this is coming to an end in April. Okay. Spirits, what messages do you have regarding this reading for Gemini? What do Gemini need to know for April? Okay, it's a time for healing. Definitely a time for healing because you've been through the tower. You've, you've been through so much pain. Someone put you through a lot of pain. And so it's time to give this up. You're at the Ten of Swords now. The Ten is an ending. An ending to this. <clears throat> and a brand new beginning coming in. Brand new beginning in love. Expect powerful change. A very, very powerful change. Very significant change here, Gemini. And this change is bringing in the sun. Complete happiness. And then you have the Ten of Cups. So a lot of happiness coming in in April. And work through your fears. Okay, Gemini, I hope there was messages in this reading to help you, and thank you for watching, and I'll see you next week. Bye, Gemini.